Hi guys, welcome to this video about a problem with KeyPass which is pretty common and that's the problem when you lose your database file like the KDB or KDBX with the new or latest version. So I had this already many many times and so this is how i solve this situation i mean of course if you work with a local version of this db database file you could be out of luck if it is really lost i mean usually it happens if you want to save i mean you open the key pass you enter your password and then you enter like you uh, add something you delete something you change something and then you press ctrl s to save and you want to close and sometimes it comes up with an error message you maybe try two or three times and then at the end it doesn't work you want to open it again and it says your database file isn't here anymore so sometimes really this program i mean as good as it is sometimes it totally messes up with open and close file and then your uh like all your passwords can be lost and this has to be prevented for uh for sure i mean uh, this is high risk of course when you lose all your passwords and everything so of course there's a, always a chance that you will find your files here everything what gets deleted should be actually in the recycle bin here on your desktop wherever you have it every windows installation has its recycle bin click on that and look for your key pass file and hopefully you will find it but i would definitely recommend to make some precautions that you cannot be trapped in this situation so what i recommend is to store your key pass file not only locally but store it on a replication of a cloud service like google drive i've been using google drive for a long time usually i'm using it i mean i use it for different things like office product to share or to freely use and also um, to store some things like the key pass and the good thing is that that everything which gets deleted which is stored on the re local replication of google drive it will you will find it in the trash bin here on google drive this has been working pretty pretty super reliable i there was not one instance where i haven't been able to find such a file this is a really good thing and of course I also use backups of my drive so even if it wouldn't be here at least I would have some backups like from yesterday I'm using the solution of spin backup spinbackup.com it's not even expensive I think it is just a couple of dollars every month maybe fifty dollars a year or not even that and it saves it does a backup every day when i have changes like in the key pass so it is really highly protected and whenever key pass deletes my database files so i can go at least if i don't find it trash bin of windows or trash bin of google drive i can find it in the daily backup of spinback so the only thing which i uh, will lose in maximum is the work from the current day and usually i should be able or you should be able to handle that so it's a pretty good combination and it saves a lot of headache and yeah that's it for now i hope i was able to help you a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments or if you have a better solution just write to the comment section below and i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time